So this is your opportunity guys if you are in defense of buying your property and if you think like you should wait or if you should buy right now, this is my best advice. What is going on guys? This is RJ Bautista, top realtor here in Central Florida with EXP Realty. Today, I'm gonna talk about if you should buy your property right now in this crazy market or you should wait a little bit before you buy your property. And also, if you are ready to buy your property but you don't have a down payment, I have a solution that for you. So make sure you stay tuned in this video from this start until the end so that you can decide either you buy your property right away or you should wait a little bit and if you don't have a down payment i could solve that problem for you all right but before you start this video if you're new to my channel welcome please subscribe and also if you found this value please don't forget to thumbs up share this video to all your social and i would highly appreciate that one so without further ado let's jump into it all right so first thing i would like to say here in this video <coughs> excuse me i just had my lunch so first thing I would like to share in this video is if you should buy your property right now. So if you don't know about the real estate market so far, in this crazy real estate market here, particularly in Florida, where I am currently located, basically in my area, in Claremont, Kissimmee, Davenport, and so on, it is a buyer's market, okay? What do you mean about buyer's market, RJ? This is confusing. In real estate, we have like a seller market and a buyer market, okay? So a buyer's market is like when the favor is on the buyers okay this is about the supply and demand so right now as we know like the interest rate is going up and also when the interest rate is going up obviously some buyers are not buying their property right now it's just because simple the interest rate is going up and also they cannot afford it to pay it every month due to high interest rate does it make sense so that is the supply and demand is going all right so if there's no demand what would happen is there are more more supplies coming in so it means like if there's more supply coming in what would happen about the price if there's no one's buying imagine if there's a lot for sale going on and there's no movement or there's no buyers what would happen about the price they decreasing decreasing decrease right it's just because of not too much demand or there's no demand buying the property simple as like that right so right now we are shifting the market we are on about to buyers market due to high interest rates which is I told you before so right now if you see the real estate market you are probably thinking wow the price is going down slowly yes there you go the price is going down slowly due to crazy market due to high interest rates so no one wants to buy their property right now is just because they cannot afford monthly bills of their mortgage so what happened is like all the sellers all the houses for sale out there they will decreasing the prices so that they can make some sale okay so it means we are having too much demand to sorry we have some too much supply in the real estate market so that if you have too much supply so the price is going down when you say like yes I think I should buy right now so for my personal opinion for my personal perspective yes if you are a buyer you should buy right now because it's in your favor for example a property for sale for 300,000 okay that 300,000 property is sit there for about one month two months three months right and no one's buying it's just because of there's no much buyers due to high interest rate so what will happen is if you are the buyer come to that deal let's say you come to me and then I found the property for you and then what would happen is we will make some offer to that particular property or that property for sale so what would happen is when we put some offer to that property we are most likely or sometimes seller most likely accept that offer because there's no much offer right now to that particular property does it make sense so when we vice versa when it's like sellers market this is what happened when the interest rate is going down it means like the economy is doing good it means like a lot of people wants to own real estate so it means a lot of people who can afford to buy their own property it means like the demand is going up so that the price of the property is going high it's just because of high demand all right so 
right now in this crazy market that we are on is we are shifting to buyer's market so should you wait to buy your property or sometimes you think I should buy right now for my personal opinion for my personal perspective yes you should buy right now even though the interest rate is high but remember the price that you will get you can get some good offer or good deal from that particular property okay and then what will happen is when the interest rate is going down what you can do to your property is refinance it all right so you can get whatever the current interest rate on that particular market for example if you get some interest rate right now if they give you or the lender or the loan officer give you like six percent interest rate yeah don't worry about it if you're ready to buy buy it now but after two years three years or four years and then the economy is doing good and also the interest rate is going down then you refinance your property so that whatever the interest rate you will get that one for example if you get your property for six percent and after four years the interest rate go down to four percent or three percent refinance it so that your monthly bill is not that much compared to six percent it will go down from three percent or four percent whatever the current market situation all right so i hope that's helpful as i promise i will add another bonus here if you are ready to buy but you don't have a down payment okay a down payment is really crucial if you are buying your property especially if you are first time home buyer yes it's crucial because you know you need to have a save money in your bank or your personal money to pay your down payment but you don't have to worry about that when you are ready all you need to do is just apply for a mortgage first or apply for a pre-approval and then when you are approved for a pre-approval we have a lot of down payment help which is going on here in our state especially if you are buying a property here in let's say in Kissimmee which is part of Osceola County I have like a website that where you can apply for down payment assistant and then what you need to do is just go towards to that website that I'm gonna show you in this video and then once you go to that website apply for it and then if you are qualified as a low income individual or family what they will do is they will give you money for down payment and then you can pay that money towards to your mortgage okay and that's not about it I have another bonus for you if you are working as a nurse or let's say if you are working in medical field you will also get a special discount I wouldn't say discount but you will get a special help from the government here in Florida which is they called a superheroes program does I say it right Superheroes Pro. Let me just check my phone. Hold on. Superheroes Pro. <laughs> that superheroes program is home for heroes. All right. I just sent that to my prospect, which is I'm talking about because he works for medical field. He's a med tech down in South Florida. And then I told him like what kind of work that you are doing right now. He said he's working in medical field. He is like a med technician, I believe. And then I said try to go to this website, which is like home for heroes, or I would put the link down here so that you could apply for your special assessment. I believe they will have like a fund for this particular down payment assistant correct me if I'm wrong I think it's about three million dollars if all these three million dollars has gone so the program will stop as well okay but you can double check the website that I will show you in his website so that you can apply as well for this particular program all right so this is your opportunity guys if you are in defense of buying your property and if you think like if you should wait or if you should buy right now this is my best advice buy if you are ready okay no matter what you say I'm not ready to buy okay you're not ready to buy but there are a lot of assistant going there to help you to own your real estate just remember real estate is a long-term gains or it's a long-term asset instead of like renting I would buy is just because of when you are buying you will get your equity in your house every year correct me if I'm wrong you will get between 1% to 2% equity in your house so the faster you buy your your own property the more the equity you will get over time I hope that makes sense so that's the video for today guys if you have question for me I would be happy to answer all your question all you need to do is just contact me I will put my email address 
down here and also my cell phone number you could text me on this telephone number or cell phone number or my work phone number whatever you call that one feel free to reach me 24 7 and i will try my best or i promise you that i will get back to you as soon as possible okay and also if you watch this video until this end comment down below real estate so i could see how many people who watch this video until this end and i really 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 appreciate your time watching my video and also thank you for your time watching this video i know i'm talking too much but i appreciate your time watching me in this whole video until next time once again thank you and i'll see you on my next video peace so it means we are having too much demand to sorry we have some we have some too much you are working as a if you oops